In previous video, I'm going to show you how to draw a chart using the Excel software. So I'm going to zoom up so you can see the information a little bit better. So here we have the month as a label for the column, and we have January, February, March, going down to December. Then we have the reading for each month, right? So these are the values that correspond with the different months and also have the total. So what you're going to do, we're going to draw the chart using this information here. So what you're going to do, um, if you're on the home tab, you're going to click insert. Then you can click recommended charts and Excel based on your information that you have here will um, give you some recommended charts so here we have the line graph we have the clustered column we have the reading represented by the stacked area so let's go to this is a line and um, we can click ok and here is our chart right so this is how you um, draw a chart now you don't need to include the total in it so i'm going to include the total and look now see it's going to cause some um sudden spike in the information so you don't need the the total so i'm going to put it back here right so and also if you only need for example from january to march you can over over here until you get that um, double pointing arrow and you're going to pull it up and see the information is represented um, as you adjust the um, the range here. So if we carry this down, we can carry this down and you see it is representing April, May, June and July. Now, if you look down here on the x-axis you have april may june i'm going to show you something so i'm going to adjust it the range to include um up from january to december we can click this button here and you will be able to switch the row and column so the months would go on the vertical axis and the reading will go on the horizontal axis okay so i'm going to change the the type of um chart so we can click on this then we can go this is all chart we can do a column chart right and see it's changed to a column there right now we can move this chart around yes and i'm going to do another chart so i'm going to select this um i'm going to put select my range here and i'm going to go to insert and i'm going to go to a pie chart 2d pie right so here we have the pie pie chart so i'm going to zoom out so i show you that you can move it and you put it right here right see and i'm going to do another chart for you so i'm going to select the range that i want including the column headings or the column titles i'm going to go to insert and i'm going to choose a insert bar chart and here we have the another type of chart right so this is how you would create a chart in microsoft excel i'm going to show you how you can actually change the chart the type of chart so i'm going to click on the chart that i want to change and i'm going to right click and here we have the option to change the chart type and here now I can change it to um, this one if I want click OK 
and there the chart type um, has been changed. I'm going to right click again, change again. I'm going to put it as a, as a, Combo, no, as a stock or area. And I'm going to click OK. And there, this is how you would change the chart type. In the next video, we'll be showing you how to do a pivot table in Excel. That's Microsoft Excel. So this brings us to the end of today's video. Please stay here until we meet again in the next video. Bye. Thanks for watching the video and don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell, like, comment and share.